Okay. Okay, so you guys saw that, right? Now, apparently, Offset was trying to get back into the good graces of Cardi B. Uh, forgive me. Shout out to my subscribers. Shout out to my viewers. Okay. Now, nothing is wrong with trying to get back with your girl, trying to fix the damages or repair the damages in your relationship. Nothing is wrong with that, you know. I think that's the mature thing to do. But I'm kind of confused because some people say that this relationship was staged. Some people say it's genuine. Some people say that she used him, you know, to get to get to get her foot wet in the game or to solidify herself in the game, in the rap game. Some people say um Offset was using her to promote his his solo album. I don't know. But my thing is like I'm kind of wondering if this was staged. Because if, if this is Cardi B's set, this is her set. Who authorized Offset to go up there and have people bring this thing, whatever this is, take me back? As you can see, it's like some boxes. I don't know what, what they are, but they're detachable, right? Because you saw people putting them together and then taking them apart when everything was over, removing them from the stage. Who gave him the authority to do that? Who allowed him to do this? This just doesn't seem like a coincidence to me. It just doesn't seem like he just went there to do that. Now, I could be wrong. I don't have the inside stories. I don't know what's going on, but... Based on how people are judging this relationship, some people are saying it's staged, whatever. I already said that before. I'm just looking in. I'm just looking in from the outside. And I'm asking myself, is this staged? Anyway. If this is genuine, if all of this is real, My thing is, why are they keeping their relationship in the public eye like that? And if this is real, why would Offset go on stage trying to make up with her? It worked for him with the, the proposal. It's not going to work here. Because right now, a lot of people are against him. A lot of her fans are against him because they have it that he cheated on her. They have it that he cheated on her. You know how women are. Women pick up for each other. And growing up, I've always known and I've learned. You never approach women when they're around their friends. No, he's approaching Cardi B in front of her audience. Her response is not going to be genuine. Because she's going to have to put up a front for her audience. So she's going to play tough. So if all of this is real, what Offset should have done was approach her backstage. Approach her at her hotel room where he could get some, you know, alone time with her. Or even if he can't get some alone time with her, approach her backstage. You know? 
But right here, he embarrassed himself. If this relationship is not staged and it's really real, you know, a real relationship, he embarrassed himself. Because what it seems like to hear, she rejected him. And women take pride in rejecting men. It does something for their egos. I don't know what it is. It makes them feel empowered and powerful when they reject you. Which is why women love to reject men. I don't know. They just do. It's wired in them. I don't know. I'm not a female. It is what it is. But if this relationship is real, he's making an ass of himself. Now... There's nothing wrong with trying to get your woman back. It's just how you do it, you know? And I don't believe trying to make a spectacle of it is gonna work in your favor. I could be wrong. Because I see this all the time when I'm watching basketball. There's some guy there trying to propose to his girlfriend, you know, and they put it on the screen. When you watch baseball, it's the same thing. Some guy trying to propose. I, I could never understand why guys do that. Like you're trying to... When they, when they do these proposals in public, it's as if you're trying to... Not shame, but you're, you're trying to pressure her into saying yes. Most of the time she says yes. She's not saying yes because she wants to, but she feels pressured to say yes because she doesn't want to embarrass you in front of all these people. So why would he go here to try to get a yes from her? Like I said, he did it before with a proposal. He got a yes. So maybe he thought it was going to work this time. Different strategy, bro. Try to approach her when she's not around a bunch of people. You might get the best of her in that moment. If this relationship is real, this was a dumb move. But I'm beginning to think this is staged and it's just fake. Because I'm still asking the question. Who authorized him to go on her set? Bringing up all of this shit. Who? So you're trying to tell me that her team didn't know? Her team didn't see him bringing all this stuff? The coordinators of the, the, of the show didn't see all of this happening? And tried to put a stop to it? Oh, something is fishy here. But anyway. That's it for me. I'm out.